hey everyone welcome back to my channel so if you're new here i go by the name of princess budgets and i am the creator of rose and Fuse budget items and the owner of princess budgets so i'm happy that you clicked on this video um if you're just now joining the budgeting community i'm so happy that you're here i'm happy that you clicked on me to tell you how this whole process works okay so what I'm going to be doing for this video is I'm going to be cash stuffing my paycheck. So when you do cash stuffing, basically what it is, is you're budgeting out your paycheck. You're seeing what you need to spend for the week. Or if you're trying to get out of the debt, this is such a good way and it's such a good method to use. Um, I'm currently not in any debt right now, but um, yeah, a lot of us use it to get out of debt. But I'm just using it to save and budget out my money and to spend wisely. So welcome we are gonna get right into it and it's gonna be a fun one so just keep on watching all right guys now whenever i take out the money we do a little chit chat so um regarding the 1k savings challenges you guys went went in okay you guys really went in i was gonna say crazy but you guys are not crazy you guys just went in whoa like super super exciting um it definitely was a roller coaster it was just a lot going on that day and so many messages like you guys you guys went in okay so um yeah so if you didn't get a chance to get the the 1k savings challenges you will be getting one like i'm going to speak it into existence okay you're getting one on june 29th because that is when i release it for the next go rounds um i'm thinking about releasing it in different time frames so what i'm thinking i'm not sure like let me know if this works for any of you guys but what i'm thinking is i'm going to be releasing it in three time slots so it's gonna be one in the morning one in the afternoon and one towards nighttime but not too late um let me know if that would work for you i'm not sure i'm still trying to see you guys but i'm i'm going towards that route instead of releasing it on just one time and like you know some of you guys work some of you guys have things to do you know i just want to make it work for all of you so let me know if that works and we can just go ahead and pick a time all together in my next video but i'm going towards that route okay so we have our money all laid out it's all nice and pretty for you guys and we're gonna go ahead and jump right in we're gonna start off with our wallet you guys know i love to start off with my wallet because it's my variable expenses something i use on a daily basis so why not so all right, starting off with gas. Gas, I think we have 30 bucks in here. I'm not sure, but um, wait, no, I don't. I took it out. We have 20 bucks. So we're gonna be putting in 40 this time. So in total, we should have 60, which is not enough. I do need about 70 bucks to fill my tank now, which is crazy, but you know, it's a lot. You just gotta roll with it. It is what it is, you guys. Um, for my meat envelope, I'm gonna go ahead and put in 25 bucks. So we have $25. It's empty, nothing new. So we're just gonna go ahead and stuff that envelope. Sorry guys, I just found lotion, so my hands is like a little slippery. Um, for dates, I'm putting in $20. I think I meant to put 25 in here and 20 in my meat envelope. So that's exactly what I'm gonna do. Cause I don't really need that much. I only buy like Starbucks, like small things, not really like any big purchases throughout the week. But yeah, that's about it. So we're done with our wallet. Now we're gonna move on to our bills. All right, jumping right into our bills binder. We're starting off with water bill. Water bill is empty and we're gonna be putting in 25 bucks in here. So that's 25. I need to like wipe my hands. It's way too slippery. Hold on. Okay, hopefully that's better. So for subscriptions, we're putting in 10 bucks. Let's see what we have so far. So 
So now we have 20, 40, 55, 56, and 57 dollars in subscriptions. Jim is getting five dollars, so we're gonna go ahead and put a five. So now we have 11 bucks in our gym envelope. Um, P.O. Box, I'm starting it all over again. We're going to be putting in $10. Ooh, okay, I guess we're going to use this 10 So $10 in here. Amazon will be getting 10 bucks as well. Um, and I think that's it to pay for my Prime membership using um, my student account. So we have 20, 20, 30, 40, 55, 65, 66, 7, 8, 9. So $69, which is enough to pay for my Prime membership, I believe. So I don't think I'm going to be stuffing it next week, but we'll see. Um, Tide is getting $50. I did go ahead and put in my last um, big payment to my church. So we're starting all over. Business is getting 100 bucks. I want to, let's use this one. So yeah, that's it for my bills binder. So we are all done. All right, moving on to our low priority binder, which is this one. So we're only stuffing rainy day and cushion. So let's go to that. Um, rainy day is getting $25. So a 20 and a five. So we have 100, 150, 170, 190, and $200 and rainy day super super cool cushion has nothing but we're putting in 50 bucks just to you know in case i went a little over budget with my credit card you know i have a little a little safety net to go back to so we're done with our low priority binder all right moving up the ladder we're going to mid priority so this binder is things that I need, but I don't really need. So kind of like in the middle, which is why I call it mid priority. So princess is getting 38 bucks. So we're going to put a 20 and a 10 and a five and three ones. So that should be 38. So we've got 500. 6, 7, 8, 50, 70, 90, 9, 10, 9, 20, 9, 30, 9, 40, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 9, 45. So we are so close to 1K, which is super cool. So we're going to switch it out when it reaches 1K to a 1K slip. Next for hubby, he's going to be getting 27 bucks. I am saving to get him um, an iPad for his for his Christmas gift, sorry, for his Christmas gift. So we've got 20, 45, six and $47 in there. Okay, moving on to gifts. Gifts will be getting $85, so 50, 70, 85. I'm not sure why I put so much in here. I think it was Mother's Day, but it already passed. So we are, I'll put it in here still, but mm, I don't know about that. I'll just keep it in here though. Um, outfits is gonna be getting 15 bucks, so we're gonna grab a 10 and a five. So we've got 500, 20, 40, 60, 70, 85. So 585 is in outfits. Moving on to Christmas, wait, let me fix it. Okay, moving on to Christmas, we've got $23 going in there. So we're gonna grab a 20 and three ones. I know I usually put 21, but we're putting in 23 now. I don't know why, but we're just gonna go with it. So 100, 200, 300, 20, 40, 60, 80, one, two, three, four. So this is 384 in Christmas. For repairs, we've got $23 going in there as well. So we're gonna grab 20 and then three ones. So that's 23. 
1, 2, 3, 20, 40, 60, 70, 1, 2, 3, 4. So 374 is in repairs. I gotta update my tracker in the back. But that's it for this binder. Okay, so for our high priority binder, we're starting off with our emergency fund. So we're putting in $50. So now we have 500, 600, 605, 67, and 608 in here. Next for apartment needs, we've got $15 going in there, so a 10 and a 5. And we have 500, 600, and 615. Moving on to future wedding. Future wedding is getting 20 bucks. So a 20. So we got 1, 2, 3, 4, 50, 71, and 50, 70. Did I say 50, 70? Okay. 1, 2, 3, 4, 50, 71, and 2. So 472. I said 4. Okay. Okay, moving on to future debt. We will be getting 20 bucks. So I'm gonna grab a 20. In total, we have 550, 71, and 572 in future sets. Moving on to future rent, we'll be getting 127. So 100, 120, 125, and then two ones to be 127. So we got 1,000, 1, 2, 3, 4, 20, 35, 40. And 1442 bucks. So we are so close to $1,500. So I might switch it out for like a $500 slip when it reaches 1.5. We'll see though. Okay, for future life bill, I'm putting in $13. So a 10 and three ones. Three. Okay, so we got. One, two, three, fifty-five. Well, sixty-five, six, seven, eight. So we have three sixty-eight in future light bill. Next for future groceries, we are putting in twenty bucks. So we're just gonna grab a twenty. So we have five hundred and seventy dollars in here. Okay, next for health stuff, we're gonna be putting in 20 bucks as well. So we're gonna grab a 20, 1, 2, 3, 4, 50, 75, and 476. Okay, for older me, we're putting in $15. So we're gonna grab a 10 and a 5. So we've got 100. 110, 15, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4. So 124. Wait, did I say? Yeah, 124. Wait, hold on. Wait. 624. I was going to say, where is the rest? Okay. So 500, 600, 610, 15, 20, 1, 2, 3, 4. So 624 is in older me. All right, so let's just move this down. And we are done with our high priority binder. All right, so for my mystery envelope, I'm putting in 930. So I'm gonna grab 9100, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 20, and a 10. So this is 930. We're gonna put that in here. Okay, last we're moving on to our challenge binder. So we're gonna be stuffing my iPhone challenge first. It will be getting 81 bucks. So that's gonna be three of these as always. So we're gonna go ahead and scribble it in. One, two, three. And let's put an 81, so 50, 70, 81. So that's 81. 
Okay, for the iMac challenge, we're putting in 340. So I'm assuming that's, yeah, that's the two 170s. So we're gonna put 340. So one, two, three, 20 and 40. really want this iMac okay i really really want it it's the biggest one and i really really want it by like december so we are on our way so let's go ahead and scribble this one in okay let it dry a bit okay so one dollar didn't save anything, didn't save any fives, and I didn't save any tens. So we're doing the vacation challenge, which not really the vacation challenge. This is just money that my boyfriend gives me, and I just put it in this envelope. I do need to change it. I might just leave it, honestly. So we're putting in 162. So 100, 150, 160, and 162. So that's going in here. And we are all done. So let me actually show you guys how to do something real quick. Yes, take notes, you guys. Make sure you're ready for the release date. It's right here on my website, June 29th. I want to release it sooner, but I'm not giving any promises. So I just want to say June 29th to be safe because I don't want to give any false hope. So. Um, I am going to be taking pre-orders soon, not now, maybe more close to the date because um, I do want to take 50 pre-orders and then the rest, the other 50 is going to be released on the same day that I, um, you know, put up the challenges, which is on the 29th. So yeah, um, and make sure, you guys, make sure that you're signed up to, where is it at? This, at the bottom of my website, it says join the princess community guys make sure you're signed up because i i spill all the tea on there okay i spill new releases i spill um discounts any sales happening you will be the first to know if you sign up for this thing it's free you just put in your email and you're done so yeah that's it for this video pretty much i hope you guys love this video i hope you guys are ready for this new release because i'm super excited it's going to be the biggest release yet for the 1k savings challenges i am going to try my best we're going to go ahead and make 100 challenges and i'm going to find a way i'm gonna find a way of how to limit it for you guys so if you guys you, so you guys can just order either one mini and one full size but you can't order multiple full sizes or multiple minis for one person like it has to be one or the other or you can pick one from each size i think that's how i'm gonna do it because i know some of you guys were telling me like girl like it's not fair like i waited and it's not fair that some people can get three challenges because i did have a lot of you guys not a lot but i got a few of you guys who ordered like three challenges or five challenges and maybe you guys want to give it away so i'm thinking this time around i think i'm gonna go ahead and do it one per customer tell me if that works for you guys tell me if that's like like no like don't do that or do you think i should do that just let me know you guys so so that is it for this video i hope you guys loved watching this video i hope you guys learned i hope you guys enjoyed it and cannot wait to see you guys next week in my next video bye guys